So today is the official first day of summer. It's called the summer solstice. And today has extra meaning for you, right? And meteorologists, because of this logo here behind us. Tell us about Very that. Very cool. Well, I, I tell you, today uh, our profession is uniting. And meteorologists are uniting all around the world. And you may have seen the hashtag MetUnite and this logo with it. And here's what it means. The campaign is called Meteorologists United on Climate Change. Nearly 100 meteorologists across the globe are wearing this logo today in an effort to raise awareness regarding climate change. These images you see are from Spain, Canada, Belgium, Italy, and here in the United States. The logo was created in England, shows the warming colors representing the warming of the planet since 1850. From colder than normal temperatures to warmer than normal temperatures, we are plus 2.4 degrees since 1850 to the present day and age. And uh, I'm wearing my cufflinks here, as you can see, uh, that uh, show the warming. Of course, I've got, I've got the cufflink up by, upside down, but you understand. That <laughs> no, looks great. <laughs> yeah, <laughs> We've gone from the colder temperatures in 1850 to the warming temperatures uh, of today. So today, of course, uh, is the first day mm -hmm. of summer. It means hotter temperatures for everybody here in the Northern Hemisphere. Now, for many, climate change is a political issue, but should it be? More than 98% of those who study climate around the world agree that the planet is indeed warming and that warming is driven by man's actions. That view is rejected by many conservatives here in the United States. But Congressman Carlos Curbelo, a Republican, is helping lead a group that is embracing the science. So we know it's real. We know that South Florida is the tip of the spear. Sea level rise is a major threat to our future here in this area. And what we're trying to do in Congress is depoliticize the issue. Today we have 31 Republican members on the record saying this is important. We need to play a role in fixing it. And uh, they have come together with 31 Democrats to form the Bipartisan Climate Solutions Caucus. So we've made great progress, but the truth is we have a long way to go. And uh, folks, uh, we will continue to enhance uh, the message that we need to act on climate. Climate change is real. It's us and it's serious.